Here she is, boys. Here she is. Oh no, she's bleeding. Oh no. What is this? Uh, it's snowing. What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Today, as you can see in the title of the video, we're gonna do uh, some updates on this guy and that guy and we're also picking up a new car so we're going to pick up a new car it's down here we already picked it up this is filmed a little bit after but i'm not going to show it to you yet i'll show you in a bit the beamer's for sale we got um the beamer for sale the glitter bomb beamer is no longer in our plans we decided to go with a different car that i'll show you in a second but yeah the beamer's for sale it's blue if anybody wants to buy it let me know hit me up in the uh hit me up in the dms on Instagram or Facebook or whatever. And other than that, we're gonna cover, like I said, the Mustang, major news for the Mustang. I've been hinting at it, but we're finally going to pick something up that will increase that uh, big time. And then the DSM, I got some boxes. I'm gonna open and show you guys some boxes and we'll cover that. So stay tuned in the video and let's get after it. They got it. I think it's way heavier than it should be. <laughs> it's got a flat. Go show the flat in the front. Where? Uh, Where the heck's the flat? Do I want a Jeep? Yeah. Uh, show the taxi. Maybe we'll take the taxi too. <laughs> Comment down below if you want the taxi. I can just sit here. <sighs> A lot of leaves under here. Uh oh, that dog coming. Oh, you got a puppy with you? Yeah. Oh, I thought it was a dog in the town here. There's a puppy in the car. Puppy! Puppy! <laughs> oh, he's not happy. <laughs> dog in the car. Bubba's going, hit him up. Mike always helps me out in Jersey. They come out and scoop you up. Got a nice truck here. So. This is the new car. It's supposed to be a surprise, but we're already filming it, so there it is. Here it comes. It's coming with us. Will. What? Video tape. Video tape you? It's, I'm almost as tall as it. Wait. Almost as tall as it? Yeah. I, I, I am higher than it's it. pretty yeah. close. What do you think of the new car? Another one sitting like right there. Yeah, well, what do you think of this one? It looks weird. It looks weird? <laughs> it's weird to have two cars. Two cars? Yeah. We have more than two cars. Or it's weird to have, have seven cars, eight cars? No. To have two of the same cars. It's not the same. This one's different. No, it's not. Yeah, it is. <laughs> You'll see when we get it home. <laughs> oh no, she's bleeding. Bleeding. <laughs> She's gonna die. <laughs> Here it is. The RX-8. It's dirty. You just saw me picking it up. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty dirty, but it'll clean up. I mean, it's just, you know, surface. It needs a good cleaning. It needs a good cleaning. But other than that, it has like a little scratches here and a dent here. Other than that, the car's in great shape. It has the red interior. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the red interior, and neither is, neither is Terry. Needs a new steering wheel, you know. It has 92,000 miles on it. Cracked over there. That's a common issue with these cars. I looked that up. That's a common issue. So, yeah, Terry's been doing some research on it. She wants to redo the interior. I don't, I don't really blame her. Uh, red's not going to really go with the theme, the color theme that she's got going on. I have 
a part that I'm making for her for Christmas coming up in a video after this that doesn't go with the red either. So red's got to go. Um, we're going to go black in, in the inside and maybe some glitter for her. I don't know what her plan is. I'm going to let her have some creative freedom with the car to make it, you know, truly hers. But it's getting an LS swap, obviously. Why wouldn't it? Um, LS turbo swap is going in this car. It currently has a motor that does not run. What else is new? The rotaries, not many of them run. <laughs> and it, well, the, you know, I shouldn't say that because some people can do some nasty things with rotaries, but not us. We don't know anything about them. So we're going LS, LS turbo swap going in this car, shooting for like 500 to 600 wheel on the turbo that I picked up a while ago. It should do it. We'll see. I don't, I don't know. I, it, it should be, it should be fine. It's kind of like Emiliano's conquest. So like low 500s on pump gas, which is plenty, plenty for her to learn on plenty for her to get uh to get into it and then down the line if we want to go bigger we could always go bigger so we'll see what happens now let's head over to check out the boxes that i got for the dsm and then we'll check out this mustang part right so as far as the dsm you guys have seen this manifold and i've showed it a couple times we're going to install this and a fuel system so i had a fuel system built up from kenny klein messaged him actually he messaged me and saying that uh, the car could be a lot faster. <laughs> so I went with the fuel setup that he recommended and uh, I ordered it out for him. He's also gonna tune my car again. He's been tuning my car. Post his Instagram right here. Hit him up if you're trying to look for a DSM tune. I got the inline fuel filter and a lot of stuff in here. It took me a while to get this box open. But this is just a lot of, a lot of connections. All your AM fittings, 90s, and that whole, the whole, you know, the whole jazz here. Line. And yeah, this is gonna be our fuel setup. We're gonna go E85. So soon the car could make like, oh look at E85. Soon the car can make 500 to 550 wheel. That's that's the goal for the car. I wanna see it make 500 wheel on the whole set and then eventually down the line, if we get bored of that or whatever, we'll go, we'll go bigger and get a precision turbo or a Borg Warner or something. We'll put something else on it that could that could flow a little better and spool a little faster. The whole set is very laggy. So we'll see what happens. I'm waiting on injectors also. I got 2150 injectors that I'm waiting on. They're back ordered because of coronavirus. What else is new? This fan's going nuts. But uh yeah, that's that. That's the DSM. We'll get it uh we'll get it cracking. That's the next thing that we're gonna do actually. Once we get all the parts, we're gonna take the DSM over to EF Speedworks, Emiliano at EF Speedworks and Get it, uh, get it going. Hey, buddy. What's up? It's pretty tight, eh? Yeah. Go ain't ahead. going anywhere. <laughs> ain't going nowhere. That ain't going nowhere. <laughs> what month is it? <laughs> I don't know. December. Oh, December. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Right. Taking up the motor. <laughs> Watch out, we're going to go on the back. Oh, by the way, guys, if you don't know, Fastenel does shipping. So if you are trying to get a motor and you're like near a Fastenel and the other guy's near a Fastenel, you could send it through Fastenel. That's how we did it. That's, That's how we pretty got cool. This, uh, are you going around back? Set up. I'm going right here. That's a nice truck. I'm going to get me a good old truck. Pop took me up with the truck. <laughs> got the... Silver, the silver Rado. What do you guys think of my Chevy? <laughs> what the fuck did I just do? That? Shit, there it goes. Lose the fuel filter. Really? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see it. Alright. <laughs> you definitely made it seem a lot bigger. I thought it would be bigger. Hopefully, there's a motor in there, right? <laughs> right? A short, you bought a short block. <laughs> oh, we didn't even tell you. There's a motor in here. Oh, guys. yeah, there's a motor. <laughs> There's some motor in this thing. You're good there. 
It's going in the new car. Oh, you didn't tell him about the new car, right? You're gonna have you're gonna have to wait for that. I think I told him about the new car. <laughs> yeah, that we we told him about the new car. It's Did in you? this video. Yeah, I just filmed it. This, I just filmed it. Oh, okay. <laughs> How far do you want it? You're uh, good there. I think you're pretty good there. We got straps. That's good. Here she is, boys. Here she is. Do they know what this is going on? I'm excited. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, you're dangerous. All right, boys. You're about to see. It doesn't look that exciting, actually. Really? Oh my god. Nope. Just one more over there. And the other side. Sure. We don't want a flat here. Oh no, that's it. That's it, that's what I'm saying. Take it out. Ta-da! <laughs> oh wow, it's not an LS. <laughs> it's, not <a> it's not an LS, boys. What do we got here? What's going on here, Will? I don't know anything about these things. Listen, we're gonna explain everything in the next video, when it's lighter out, and I'll give you guys a a detailed uh, review of what we picked up. But oh no! It's going in the Mustang. You gotta blur the other one. No, they've already seen that. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so, we, we kind of had no choice but, yeah, look at this fail. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We've got the motor here and the engine hoist there. Not really sure how we're gonna get it out. Pound. But, you know. Is it just a belt? Tell me. Oh no, it's not bolted down. She's here. free. She's, uh, she's, she's free. Yeah, it's free. It's just on the head here. Oh, that, that was close. All right. I don't know what's up with the fuel system. As far as what's hanging and what's not. Okay. Give me, give me that. There's a bunch of fuel stuff. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. All right, I'm gonna pull the truck forward, all right? <laughs> Hold on, I gotta... <laughs> Nothing for you here, doggy. Oh, why are you stopping? Okay, now I feel much better about moving it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'd rather move it now. All right, guys, the final code word. This is our last chance to enter. First 10 people. Panda. Aubrey picked this one out. Panda. Comment Panda down below. First 10 people. I already have the first 20 from the first two videos, so this is your chance. Panda. Welcome back, guys. We made it home. Here's a turbo for it. Uh, I don't know. We'll just catch you guys in the next one. Peace.